Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with another bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of uh, Libra. The topic of the reading is, whoever it is that you're dealing with, you really wonder at times, do they intend to marry you or not? This reading will help you know that. So Libras, let's find out. Do they intend to marry you? We are going to be... Um, putting out oracle guidance as well in this reading so stay tuned and before i dive into the read let me remind you it's a general read it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there so pick whatever resonates i'll leave the rest for personal reads you can always reach out to me on my email id in the description box you can also um check out other services including palm readings as well in the description box uh, that i'm offering right now so yeah let's see do they intend to marry you whoever it is that you're dealing with let's find out if this person intends to marry you or not do they intend to marry you whoever it is that you have on your mind let's see I'm not going to pull out any card on my own. I will wait for the card to come out as an answer to that question that we are posing right now. Do they intend to marry you? I would suggest you to think of your person so their energy wow could come out. We do have Ace of Swords. I really feel like, you know, your person is... Um, they, they have kind of like, you know, closed their eyes, eyes around it for now. Like, you know, it's, it's not something that they... Um, they can feel that they can uh, see that they can uh, wish to pursue for now I really feel like you know they are just trying to observe all and everything for now whoever it is that you're dealing with I really feel like you know this person is somebody who is very um, strong-headed so I really don't think that this person is gonna um, until unless this person is so 100% sure this person is not gonna be letting that be revealed to you their intention around they want to get married so they might not tell you that they love you if they don't mean saying it and if they mean saying it they will directly marry you so as of now i really feel like you know there is something which is not there yet for them i really feel like you know this is not you know this person is definitely not intending to marry you as of now we do have ace of pentacles um the world Things are going to change though. King of Pentacles and the Sun and then the Judgment. I really feel like, you know, um, this person is not going to give you commitment. This person is not going to get married to you until unless they feel that they are ready and prepared for all of that. Now, for majority of you right now, I really feel like, you know, your person would still need some time, probably a month time or two months time before they can make their choice and decision about you right now they are doing with the um do, doing something with with regards to their money which is the most important thing for them um once that is done i feel like you know, they are not going to take more than a month time for majority of you one month is the max or probably one month and 10 days is the max that this person is going to take and um, that's when this person is going to decide uh you know i really feel like you know a person is somebody who's uh, who's a very um um how do I say it? This person is not romantic. They are very practical. So, you know, love is not love, love for them. It's it's more like, um, you know, if they have to get married, they are going to get married. Uh, not because they want, you know, um, a romantic relationship or something like that. They, they, they go with the with a very uh, dry approach towards romance and everything that uh, it it is like you know all about i feel like an you know, a person is somebody who's a completely different kind of a you know person uh whether it's a guy you are dealing with whether it's a girl you are dealing with they are emotionally um or romantically constipated this person is not somebody who's very flowy with uh, with with all of that lovey-dovey stuff i really feel like you know this person is very practical they are going to be very um you know they, they might come one day and tell you that okay fine let's get married i'm ready for it now and it is going to be something like that coming for you in regards to this connection that you have right now with this person and uh, the person on your mind i really feel like you know they will come and they will be like let's get married and you're going to be like why what you know, even if you are in no contact situation, this person is going to come back to you to ask you for, for that. Now, what I see here is um, 
you are going to accept this person for majority of you. Why? Because you believe that this is the justice that you waited for. This is the justice that you craved for. This is the love that you wanted in your life. And I really feel like you, know, you will be happy to accept this person as, as a life partner when they approach you. But for now, I really feel like you know, this person is not intending to get married to you right now. Because if they did, they would have married you already right now this person is still trying to observe all and everything so they really want to make sure that every area of their life is very perfect in each and every possible way when that is done this person is proposing you so for now or you know when they started off with you probably that was not intention for them uh they are going to think of marriage and when they think of marriage they're going to intend to marry you so that's how they go about it so uh, but yes i feel like you know the good news is that yes they will be approaching you with a love offer uh, with a commitment with a marriage but probably it is going to take some time more which is probably a month or 10 days more uh, than a month but not more than that i really feel like it's going to come quick uh for majority of you no matter how old your connection is it doesn't matter but the energy around marriage or intention around marriage is coming in within um one month time so let's see what else is coming in for you with this person let's see So we have the man holding a heart and the woman holding a heart, then the man holding the coin, the world. Then we do have the temple path and anxiety. I feel like in a majority of you, it's hard for you to stay positive. You are feeling anxious. When, 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 how, how, how? Um, I really feel like the divine really wants you to go temple path around it. Try not to upset yourself with whens and hows and you know why nots right now it's time for you to just believe that everything is going to fall into place all is going to be well so you just need to relax you just need to kind of like you know allow things to happen um for majority of you this person um will take time like i said earlier uh at times you might feel like you know maybe they are with you because of the sexual relationship that you share or maybe you are you know uh, they are with you just because um for the sake of it and they don't even love you but their love and your love is completely a different thing you are probably somebody who's very romantic and this person is not you're probably somebody who's uh, very uh much into them but they are not like that you know they are making sure that they are keeping healthy balance in all other areas of their life as well not just love is the top priority for them um in fact for them probably it's like you know if if we see it from your perspective maybe you're gonna feel like you know they are very materialistic but uh they are a provider and they have to be a certain way. That's how they see it. Uh, but yes, I feel like, you know, uh, when they are ready, they are going to make sure that uh, they maintain healthy balance between work and love. But for now, work is the important thing for them. Once they are ready, yes, they are coming towards you and uh, they are going to let you know that they want to marry you. But for now, I really feel like, you know, just, just give this person one month and 10 days more and see um, things changing in this connection. So let's see. What do you need to do right now? As you wait while you wait, what is it that you can do to speed things up? What is it that you can do to speed things up with the Oracle Guidance? Let's see, what can you do to speed things up? What can you do to speed things up? What can you do to speed things up? Um, you have to relax yourself and uh, you have to work through your fears because your fears are not going to get you anywhere. So the Divine really wants you to work through that. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read. If it was of help, do like, share, and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.